Okay, so this week I wanted to talk about the fight or flight response because a lot of autistic people have said that they feel as if their own personal flight or fight or flight response is a bit easier to trigger than other people that they know. So first, what is the fight or flight response? The fight or flight response is part of your body's natural defense system. When you encounter something dangerous, your brain goes into a mode that is basically fight, flight, or freeze, the three big Fs, and it's a protection. You know, your, your, your adrenaline pumps into your system, and that's the first thing you feel. You may feel your heart start to pump. I generally, like, I'll start sweating profusely in my palms or my armpits. I may also get, like, nauseous when the adrenaline hits. Uh, and, like, if I'm about to eat and then all of a sudden I've got a hit of adrenaline, I am no longer hungry. I'm totally just ruined. I may actually get digestive distress. I might even throw up if it's bad enough. That adrenaline in your system creates a lot of physical symptoms, even if you're able to mentally tune all of that out. And, you know, your body is preparing to protect you. You know, if there's danger, the signals are supposed to tell you to run away or protect yourself. But unfortunately, for some people, for very for different reasons, uh, that fight or flight response might be being triggered in situations that aren't useful. Causing, you know, those adrenaline rushes to just pour through your body and causing panic attacks, which also suck, or uh, just causing, you know, a lot of different unpleasant things. And so that's that flight or flight response. All of a sudden, you know, you're, you're getting this message, run, run, get away. And so that's what you do, unless you freeze or fight. And then you're like, fight, fight. And, and it's, it's a complete takeover of the mind by this adrenaline system. And all you can do is sit and wait for it to go away. Have you experienced this? Let me know your experiences. What do you do to make it stop? All right, guys, I'll talk to you next week. Bye.